Welcome to WebBikeWorld.com. This is a quick look at the new Cena SMH5 motorcycle Bluetooth intercom system. For the full review, more photos, and all the details on this intercom and many more, please visit WebBikeWorld.com. We introduced the Cena SMH5 in our live report from the 2012 Dealer Expo in February, and the SMH5 is now being shipped. The SMH5 is about a two-thirds scale SMH10 intercom, yet it has most of the features of the SMH10, and it should satisfy anyone looking for an easy-to-use basic motorcycle intercom system. The SMH5 has all the features most riders need, including Bluetooth 3.0, rider-to-rider wireless capability, multi-pairing, basic voice prompts, stereo A2DP, and playback control using AVRCP, and the classic Cena jog dial control interface and more. Here it is compared to the larger SMH10 on the right. Be sure to read the full webbikeworld.com review to learn about the differences in these intercom systems. The SMH5 connects via a mini USB port instead of the pins used on the older SMH10 units. The SMH5 dual set comes with two USB cables, which are used to charge the batteries. You also get a pair of microphone windsocks and the headsets with smaller size stereo speakers. Some accessories are available also. The headset connects via the mini USB port. The SMH5 comes with a nice metal helmet clamp and the intercom module slides onto the clamp and holds with a friction clip. You also get a stick-on helmet mount for each module and a holder for the boom mic which can be mounted inside the helmet. The SMH5 comes with a very basic instruction guide and the full manual is available for download from the Cena website. Press and hold the jog dial and the red phone button to start the unit. The LED blinks to indicate the battery life. Press and hold the phone button to put the intercom into pairing mode. Phone pairing. Press both the jog dial on the phone button and the unit immediately shuts off. Goodbye. The jog dial turns for volume control and it is pushed to connect to the paired intercoms and control other features. Here's the battery check. Four red flashes means 70 to 100% battery charge. The battery life indicator in the instruction guide shows you how. The SMH5 is an easy fit on most helmets, although many helmets are now being made with complex moldings along the bottom, which can make it difficult to use the mount, so you may need the double-sided tape mount instead. Here's my trusty Sony Bluetooth adapter and an old MP3 player, so let's see how it connects. We have a review of this Bluetooth adapter and others also on webbikeworld.com. Press and hold the Sony Bluetooth adapter to put it into pairing mode. Then press the phone button on the SMH5 for 5 seconds to put it into pairing mode. Then the two units will pair, which then allows me to stream music or listen to the radio. Put the SMH5 in pairing mode again and pair it with my non-smart cell phone. phone Put my phone in discovery mode and it finds the SMH5 and it pairs. Then I can connect it and I'm all set. I can now make or take calls using the intercom. I'll turn off the intercom and next time I turn it on, it will find the phone and connect automatically. So that's a quick look at the new Cena SMH5 intercom system. 
For all the details, specifications, lots more photos, and our opinion on this intercom, please read the fullwebbikeworld.com review. Thanks for watching.